need you to stay in here, son. Please, and don't come out for any reason. I love you. showing up any minute now. Go pack some things. We're gonna go steal my brother Wong for the time being. I'll grab Shen. Shen, I need you to unlock the door. We're gonna go stay with Uncle Wong for a while. I was always impressed by you. But at the same time, I envy you as well. You have the perfect home, perfect wife, perfect life. <laughs> you even managed to teach your son everything we know. He'll be a perfect assassin. You will stay away from my son. I will not let you corrupt him. I don't want him to have blood on his hands like me. I'm sending him away from here. <laughs> no worries, because after what I'm about to do, he'll be searching for me. No. No! <laughs> You'll be joining her soon. No one abandons and betrays the hand. Your debt will be paid in your death. <laughs> Shenzu, your debt is paid. So, what do we do about the boy? We find him. He's gonna be a great asset and leader of the hand. This is the place. Hey. <laughs> you lost, girly? Oh, I think she is. Stay away from me. Oh, don't worry. We're going to help you find your way. No! Get off me! Don't worry, I got him. Oh, damn it. This guy's good. Get the hell out of here. Are you okay, miss? Thank you. Thank you so much. No worries. Please, come inside. I'm really grateful for what you've done. Uh, it's no problem, uh, Ms. Oh, S Samantha. But you can call me Sam. So, Samantha. Why come to New York? Well... To start over, actually. I had a really bad breakup, and I needed a change, so I decided to pack up and move on over to the States. Ah, and I assume you want to learn Kung Fu? I mean, there's not too many dojos nearby. I'm the only one in this area. Yes, I would. Especially after being confronted by those horrid men. It certainly couldn't hurt to learn a few moves. <laughs> I would love to teach you, Samantha. Really? Oh, that's splendid. I sadly don't have the time today because I have to get going to work, but I'll take your number and I'll give you a call. Sure. My number is on the flyer out in the hall. Oh, excuse me. I I'm sorry. Um, I wanted to schedule a session, if that's all right. Oh, of course. Anytime you want. Mm, she's pretty. <laughs> she's only here to learn Kung Fu, Uncle Wong. That's it. Still, it wouldn't hurt to loosen up sometimes. Make some friends. I, I have friends, Uncle. Well, I don't think a Wing Chun dummy counts as a friend, <laughs> but okay. But I've also asked some friends in the neighborhood, and they said that I witnessed the same hand ninjas that's in Hell's Kitchen. So, the hand has set up a nest here in New York. Thanks, Uncle. Listen, you don't need to do this. I promised your father that I would sway you from this path. 
I have to do this. The man that is in charge of the hand killed my mom and dad. I'm sorry, brother. Sir, we found him. Where is he? He's been spotted in Hell's Kitchen. Death dealer, take some of the hand and go retrieve him. So, this is where you've been hiding. Little assassin all grown up. <laughs> Glad you made it. Never thought you would leave that dojo. <laughs> My uncle don't think I have any friends. What's going on, Danny? Uh, who's this? Oh, it's a really good friend of mine. His name is Shang-Chi. Well, a friend of yours is a friend of mine. I'm Luke, Luke Cage. Uh, I know who you are. You guys are pretty famous. <laughs> I guess so. Hey Stan, what can I get you? So, you want to know where the hand is located? My uncle tells me that some eyewitnesses have spotted them in here, in, in Hell's Kitchen. Yeah, uh, myself and Matt have been trying to figure out where they came from. It's almost as if they just appeared here. I want to help you because I know how important this is to you. Thanks, Danny. I mean that. I'm also going to get in contact with Matt. Bring him in on this as well. Sure, yeah. The more help, the more quicker we can take these guys down. But, uh, let me get back to the dojo. Huh, right behind you. That way I can beat you in a sparring match, like old times. If I remember correctly, I beat you most of those matches. Follow them. Let's see where they're headed. Move! Oh, uh, Samantha. Hi, is this a bad time? No, <laughs> not at all. She's pretty, man. <coughs> <laughs> I wasn't expecting you till tomorrow. I know, but, um, I left work early and I really don't like being bored, so I figured I have a class today and tomorrow. <laughs> I'm sorry, I should have called. Oh, no, you're fine. Don't worry. Since she's willing to learn, let's show her a demonstration. I'd love that. Huh. And I promised I won't embarrass him in front of you. Oh, that was so impressive. What's happening? Huh, just some uninvited guests, that's all. Samantha, I need you to get to safety. Go run out the back way, now. Retrieve him, now. not safe here. We need to go somewhere. Should have asked your girlfriend if we could come over. That's not funny, Danny. Our master is to sp Your master will not be speaking with anyone today. Uncle Wong, glad you made it. Come on, we must leave here quick. More of them are coming. So, this is where you work. Man, I always wanted to see how it looked in here. Yeah, you know, when I first told your dad, he couldn't believe it. He was really happy I was doing something to better things in the world. Yeah, I remember he always told me you work for a wizard. It was the coolest thing to hear as a kid. I have to avenge him, Wong. I have to. No, you don't. I get it, you want to bring them to justice, trust me. I dream of the day he'd be brought down, but I made a promise to your father to keep you safe from him. 
This was your father's. He was planning on giving it to you when you got older. If you're going to take these guys down, you need to tap into your chi, not your anger. Where are you going? I'm going home for a little bit. Are you sure that's a good idea? Yeah. There's something that I need to do alone. Cool. I'll go contact Matt. You want to take the hand down? We're going to need extra hands. Matt's been investigating the hand for months now. What do you mean he got away? Where did he go? No idea, sir. I've waited searched too long for this boy. He will lead the hand. He has the potential to lead the hand. Something his father tried to stop. What is it you want us to do now? Bring him to me. I want to speak with him. We have some catching up to do. Fin Fang Foom, I summon to speak with you. <sighs> what is the status of King Shen's son here? I'm working on it, but he's a good fighter. His skills surpass what I expected. I don't want to hear excuses. Bring me Shen's son. Since you couldn't restrain your brute, the ceremony couldn't be completed. I will fix this. I'm sorry. <coughs> <coughs> but before I go, I must ask for some assistance. I wish you would grant me more power. You want me to grant you more power? Fine. Whatever it takes for you to fix the problems you caused. Uh, hello. Hi, it's me, Samantha. Oh, Samantha, hey. Uh, listen, I'm sorry for earlier. I, I hope you still would like to learn Kung Fu. Of course I'd still like to learn. You know, I've been thinking. Probably any person or... <laughs> rather sane person would run and hide after what happened today, but it was exciting for me. Probably the most fun I've ever had. I must say, Samantha, you are one of a kind. Why, thank you. You as well, but, um, I just wanted to call and say thank you once again for earlier. And I can't wait to see you tomorrow. <laughs> Likewise. Well, I'll let you go. Bye-bye. Just a moment. Danny, um, now is not a good time. I have someone over. What? Really? Wh who's in there? Uh, a, a girl. That's who was in here. Well, clearly, you wouldn't be so secretive. Just, who is it? Oh, uh, sup, Electra. Dude, seriously, you two should just get married. You guys are made for each other. We were going over some hand incidents and sightings. I was gonna call you, but... Hey, no need to explain. We'll just pick this up tomorrow in my friend's dojo. Alright, sounds good. I'll call someone. They'll be able to help us as well. Surprisingly enough, Electra tells me they worked on taking down the hand before. Oh, cool. We'll make the call. I'll let my friend know. Welcome to your class. You could just call me Logan. Um, Mr. Logan? What will you be teaching us today? Well, Charles believes I could teach a class of self-control and teamwork. Well, that's pretty ironic. My brother always tells me you lack self-control and you don't play well with others. He would be correct. But when it matters most and the team needs me, I'm there. Um, why would we need to learn self-control? Well... Let's say you're out on a mission with Flame Boy in the back. You wouldn't want him to lose self-control because he could cause danger to everyone. Then how do you have self-control? How do you maintain it? I don't. I use it to my advantage. That works for some people. Laura, want to help me show them what I mean? Okay, remember how I told you. Breathe, and then... Now, you give it a try. See, sometimes you can use your emotions to your advantage. Logan, you have a call waiting for you. Who's this? My name is Matt Murdock. You've been working with a friend of mine whose name is Electra. That doesn't really explain why you called, Bob. I can use your help on taking down the hand. I can 
send you the location I managed to find where they're hiding out. Send me the location. I'll check it out tomorrow. Hi, I'm here. I'm ready to learn some more moves. <laughs> then let's begin. So, first lesson on Kung Fu is understanding Kung Fu. It is meant for self-discipline, overcoming pride, fear, doubts, anything negative that disturbs your inner peace. I'll be honest with you, you did very well today, Samantha. Really? Uh, thank you. Um, so if you don't mind my asking, what's your story? Why did you come to America? Well, my parents died when I was only a kid. So my uncle felt it was best for me to move here with him. And for the longest time, I was so upset. I didn't want to leave home home. I'm, I'm so sorry. I understand how you feel. I lived with my father all my life, and when he died, I was beyond sad. But I knew that I couldn't hold on to that grief, so I tell you, don't hold on to anger. You've got to let it go. I can't. Do you want to know something funny? This is my first time kissing someone when I don't even know their name. My name is Shang-Chi. Well, pleased to meet you, Shanji. <laughs> you need to come with us. Our master is expecting your arrival. Go, stand by the door. I want you out of the way. I'll handle this. Master Wu will be seeing you now. You will surrender, or we will deliver you to him by force. <laughs> I don't think so. Not today. Grab him. Let's see how you handle against us. <laughs> we got him. But what about the girl over there? She's not our concern. We have what we came for. Hey, Shang, you here? The hand must have been here. They took him. Wait. something. Do you hear that? Uh, no, I don't. What is it? Please don't hurt me. Oh, hey, hey. It's just us. Where's Shang? They took him. Did you see who or what they look like? There was some guy wearing all black and the other guy was wearing blue. Hand has him. We need to save him fast. Yeah, but where? I mean, have you managed to find where they're located at in Hell's Kitchen? Yeah. Electra gave me some tips on where to look. Let's go. Okay, come on, wait. We have to tell Wong first. I had to let him know the news. Wong? Why Wong? Because that's his uncle. And we'll need him if we want to get to him fast. The boy I've been searching for. I knew your father. What do you want from me? You were chosen by Fin Fang Foom the moment your father decided to teach you Kung Fu and let you in the hand. Fin Fang Foom has had an eye on you, boy. <laughs> your father was not all good how your uncle made him out to be. Your father has more innocent blood on his hands than I do. Time to complete what should have happened a long time ago. Lock him up. Something suspicious is going on down there. I better call Matt. Logan, please tell me you have something. Yeah, I do. I searched high and low for this place. Hand ninjas are patrolling the area as if they're guarding something. Okay. Send us the coordinates. Me and Danny are on our way now. There's a noise. Go check it out. Now. Hey, Matt. I found your friend. He's being held in some room. He's guarded. How close are you guys? We're right here, Logan. Just made it here. What? How did you get here so fast? Where's my nephew? He's inside. 
Looks like some sort of ceremony is starting. We need to get in there and help him right now. We can't let that ceremony go through. We'll need to split up. Some of us will have to hold off the hand for you to get him out safely. How do you sleep at night after seeing that? I don't lose any sleep over killing people like this. He's not doing so well. We need to leave fast. You are not leaving with him. You free him. I'll hold this guy back. Man, that guy kicks and punches got some force to them. Come on, let's go. I can open a portal for us. Come on guys, let's go. We can escape, we got him. No! Oh Wong, you made a big mistake. What happened? You had Shin's son and you lost him. I'm sorry, please forgive me. I promise you I will fix this. Be that as it may, this is your last empty promise you make to me. Bring me Shang-Chi! Is he, Steven? Will he be okay? He's fine. He's just dehydrated. Whatever was happening to him, it was draining his life force. What were they doing to him? They were preparing him for Fin Fang Foom. Fin Fang Foom? The Black Dragon? I thought that was just a myth. No. It's closer to the truth than anything. And now that we disturbed the ceremony, Fin Fang Foom is not going to be happy now. Well, now that the ceremony is disturbed, what are they going to do now? Well, they're going to try again to take him. We can't let that happen. We can't let them take him. Uncle Wong, what are you doing? You're supposed to be resting. I need you to be honest with me, Uncle. Was my father a bad man? Your father has done bad in his early life, but all that changed when you were born. Your father left the hand because he knew later they would want to try to take you. He trained you as if you were one of them. And so that way, if one day they'll come after me, I'll be able to defend myself. <laughs> yeah, but trust me, they're gonna keep trying. They won't stop. Well, it won't matter this time. I must fight him to stop this. Are you sure you want to do that? Yeah. It only set things right by taking him down. skills are very impressive. I'm here to strike a deal with you. We fight. If I lose, Fin Fein Foon can have me. But if you lose, you leave New York. Well, you see, that won't be happening. You'll have to kill me. If you must die, so be it. <laughs> Your father's sword. How special of a moment that was for him. He was gonna give it to you before he died. Hm. Do not bring up my father's name. Today, we fight <laughs> to the death. Very skilled with your father's sword. Let's see how you are in hand to hand.
<laughs> Just like your father, you really don't know your full potential. He has the fire chi. He's the one for Fin Fang Foom. Your debt is paid, and now you will burn. So what do we do now that the master is dead? Who will lead the hand? With the master now dead, I am the one to lead the hand. I did it. I avenged you and mom. Now may you both rest easy, knowing that Wen Wu is dead. Are you all right? Samantha, I, I'm really happy you came. I, I want to thank you because, because of you, I was able to let go of my anger. I'm so happy to hear that. Sadly, I, I can't stay. I understand. But I, I will never forget you, Samantha. Promise me you won't. I promise. I won't. Farewell and stay safe. Um, I hope this isn't a bad time. I don't mean to intrude. Uh, no, you're fine. I just... I'm a little confused on who you are. My name is Jimmy Wu, and I am the founder of Atlas Foundation and the leader of Agents of Atlas. I come here with a proposition for you. Huh. I'm listening. That's funny. What? What happened, Tony? There's some irregular activity in my armory. Hmm. You think someone is trying to steal something out of it? Ah, we can't be too sure. I'll call Pepper and see if she knows or has noticed anything funny in the armory storage department. All right. Anything you want me to do? Uh, yes. We're going to be working late, so order a pizza, and I'll have Happy bring us some beers. Are you Tony Stank? <laughs> yes, this is yes, this is this is Tony Stank. You found the right guy. <laughs> Thank you for that. I am never dropping this, by the way. I'm telling everyone. <laughs> Good evening, Mr. Stank. Thanks, Stan. Appreciate it. Guys, look, over there. I think that's the Milano. What is a Milano? It's the Guardians. It's their ship. We should go over there and see if they're okay. And warn them about Galactus. And see if they'll help us in the fight against him. Huh, that's a good idea. Let's go. What the? Where did the Milano go? Huh. That's a really good question. Uh, Nova, watch out! Nova, Nova, are you okay? I'm gonna make you pay! Well, what a surprise. Two former heralds of Galactus. You both are on the wrong side of things. I don't think that we are. Do you really think you can stop Galactus? <laughs> then you're wrong. It'll be quite easy to kill both of you right now. But I have a better idea. I'm just gonna send you back to Earth so you can warn them that the Eater of Worlds is close. And what should we do with these two? Let them fall into deep space. 